hello everyone and welcome again in a new video tutorial today guys I'm going to show you how you can disable and delete Microsoft OneDrive so if you don't want to use it anymore or you don't feel to keep it on your hard disk then the easy way will be to delete it from the control panel to disinstall it however first you will have to make sure that the that, that Microsoft OneDrive is not working is not running so you will have to go to your taskbar you click and you see where is it the two cloud you click on it with the right button of the mouse and you click exit close one drive and that's it so for the people who want only to disable it then you have to go to your taskbar you click again with the right button of the mouse you open task manager you click more details you go to start up and you click with the right button of the mouse on Microsoft OneDrive and you click disable so whenever you start your computer it wouldn't be running this this is for people who want to keep it. For the people who want to delete it definitively, so they will have to go to, to the search button and they type control panel. Let's open the control panel. If you have a different view than this one or a window appearing with different look, don't worry, you will have just to change the view from small icon or large icon to category. And then you go to, sorry, you go to programs and you select and install a program and now we will have to locate Microsoft OneDrive so search by M Microsoft OneDrive we will click on it two times and we will click with the right bottom of the mouse and we we'll select install and as soon as you have clicked and install as you can see the software is gone this is the disinstallation process it's really very fast uh, we couldn't even see it passing I hope this video tutorial was helpful to you guys if you still need help or assistance with it you can always contact us by either leaving a comment or through email thanks for watching if you like this video please press like share and subscribe and wait for our next video to help you with more problems thanks